Across the Piedmont Triad, doctors are finally seeing a downward trend in strep throat cases among children. Although it's usually seen in the fall and winter, they are still asking parents to be aware during the summer months. Fox 8 Celeste Smith has the story. Most of our patients are coming in um, typically with a pretty sore throat, fever, headache and stomach ache, and kind of the lack of cold-like symptoms with it. Doctors in the triad say they've treated a high number of kids infected with group A strep in the last four to five months. 20 plus kids a week with sore throat and probably over half of them at that time were testing positive for strep and we were worried about strep throat. Clinics felt like we were doing more strep swabs and have and treating more cases of strep and there's really been much less of that in the past two weeks or so. Although an uptick in strep throat cases usually comes in the winter, doctors say you should be aware cases can spike any time of year. Time of year has become relative after the pandemic. We're seeing some things a little bit earlier, a little bit later than we typically would. In the last two to four weeks, doctors are glad to see fewer kids with the infection. I would say now we're probably seeing maybe 15 to 20 kids a week, so still approximately the same number with kids coming in with sore throats. We're having fewer positive tests and fewer concerns for group A strep. They're asking parents to monitor their kids for symptoms and offer additional ideas on things you can do to prevent you or your child from getting strep this summer continue the good hand washing habits that we learned through the pandemic to try to prevent not just strep, but other infectious diseases that are out there. Celeste Smith, Fox 8 News. The Guilford County Health Department does not track strep cases in the county.